Lovely. Lovely. <laughs> Nice one, dude. Fishy splashing sand in daddy's eyes. Whee! Hi guys. I'm going to show the beginners who want to up their game how to hook a full sardine onto a double hook shared trace. For the beginners, I would recommend that you use a float when fishing for shad if you have a look at my videos you would find that i caught shad using a trace that did not have a float it is a bit more trickier and the fish is a bit more faster you've got to feel it and you've got to strike a bit more earlier but for the beginners i would recommend that you use a float when fishing for shad all you have to do is take your sardine make sure that you've got fishing cotton i'm using cotton that has been wrapped around a pvc pipe that's rolled by my dad so this is medium strength fishing cotton and we've been fishing with this for years. Cut the tail grab a hold of your shad trace double hook steel wire The longer hook must be hooked in to the bottom of the sardine and I normally place the second hook without hooking it but I place it proud around the sardine belly. Hold your cotton and you start to wrap the cotton around. Guys, this can get messy, so make sure to keep a bucket of water by your side. And make a small little loop. Once. 
twice. Put your cotton aside. And that is your full sardine with a float fishing for shad. Nine times out of 10, the shad's going to bite around the belly first and around the tail area for the second time. So you may only get two bites and the bait's gonna be gone. 